Hello, my name is Richard Cronice. Thanks for visiting richardcronice.com today or finding me on YouTube, on my YouTube channel. My purpose today is to help you with my very best technique on mastering ITO, input, inputs, tools, techniques, and output for the PMP. So here's my favorite technique. This will take about oh, five minutes or less. What are we learning? This is my best technique for mastering ITO for PMBOK 5 or any version of PMBOK. This will be a short lesson. I think it will take just five minutes or less. Elsewhere on YouTube, you can find my 14-minute video on different ways to master ITO. It's more detailed. But this is just my best technique for taking care of ITO. Before we begin, just a few things about myself. That's me over there on the right. You've already seen me on a webcam. My name is Unique. It is my brand. I am the only Richard Cronice in the U.S. or anywhere. I hope that you'll visit my website. It's located at richardcronice.com. And it's there where I offer advice on passing the PMP and also some of my PMP learning services. And if you're watching me on YouTube today, please subscribe. That would be very nice of you. So let's get to it. Memorizing ITO. What's my advice? Don't do it. Don't try it. Don't focus on memorizing ITO because it means you have to memorize over 250 inputs, tools, techniques, and outputs. What do I recommend instead? I recommend that you memorize the processes perfectly. The PMP processes, all 47 of them now for PMBOK 5, or whatever number it will be for PMBOK 6. Memorize the processes perfectly and be able to write them down for your PMP test brain dump. If you know the processes perfectly, learning ITO or understanding ITO will be much easier. Don't you agree? So understand ITO thoroughly. And how do you do that? Well, you do that through study. You take your PMI required class and you pay attention and take notes. You read Pimbach in one complimentary text. Currently I'm reading uh, someone, his last name is Akter, and he has a very nice book. Or you can stay with Mulcahy, Heldman, Crow, etc. Now, take serious notes. I provide a beautiful Microsoft Word template for taking great PMP notes on my website. You can find it there. So the real key, the real key to, you know, memorizing ITO is to use gap analysis. That's the key concept to learn. So how do you do that? Well, you use gap analysis to identify your weak ITO areas. How do you do it? You take PMP practice tests constantly. I use Kaplan's uh, selftestsoftware.com. You could use some other service. And in the process of taking all of these tests and studying all of these questions and answers, you will learn to identify your ITO weaknesses. Like I said, if you take enough tests and you record your incorrect answers, you'll understand where you're weak. And my testing showed that I was weak in ITO for quality and procurement processes. So when I realized that was a problem, I memorized ITO perfectly for those weak processes. So less than a week from my exam, I memorized ITO perfectly for the quality and procurement knowledge areas. It was a good idea. So here's the summary. What have we learned? Don't memorize ITO, learn ITO. And this is very important. It's actually advice that I'm giving some of my Skype uh, uh, consult clients. Use gap analysis through PMP practice tests to identify your ITO weaknesses in certain process groups. Perfectly memorize, then perfectly memorize ITO for your weak areas. That's it. That's all you have to do. So I'd like you to visit richardcronice.com or uh, see me over on YouTube. And uh, I'd like to thank you so much for dropping by and for listening for over four or five minutes. I hope you understand the key to passing or key to passing the PMP, a lot of folks, you see the questions all the time, how do I memorize ITO, how do I memorize ITO? You memorize the 47 rock solid, the 47 processes, or whatever number it is of processes that currently exist for the PMP. And as for ITO, you use gap analysis to find your weaknesses and then memorize ITO perfectly in those areas. My name is Richard Cronice, and I hope that you'll visit my website, richardcronice.com, or visit me on YouTube and subscribe. Thank you so much and best wishes on passing the PMP.